You should have seen him dancing to Viva España. How embarrassing. Oh, yeah, like, you know, he was bladders. Well, as long as you enjoy it yourselves, as I always say, I say, Hazel, holidays are a treat, but real life begins and ends at home. How can you say that? You've been all over the place past couple of years. Yeah, well, now I'm thinking of staying put for a bit. I've been looking at properties while you've been away for us to rent. Oh, you've not signed anything, have you? No, no, of course not. If we're going to share, you've got to have your say. Well, we've been talking and we've decided to stay as is. See how things go. Here? Yeah. Don't mind, dear. No. No, of course not. Paddy will be chuffed. He's fallen in love with my shepherd's pie. Oh, he'd fall in love with anybody's shepherd's pie, believe me. He needs his fuel in his job. Good morning, boys. Did you have a good time? All apart from missing you. Oh, oh. you creep. Uh, you carry on, love, I don't mind. Uh, I saw Kane earlier. Right. Yeah, well, he's gone into town, but he said to remind you to shift that car of yours because he's sick of looking at it. Yeah, tell me about it. He's texted me all the time when I've been away. It's cost me a bum. Yeah, and he said don't be late because Ryan's still, well, you know. Yeah, yeah, I'm not going to forget that, Pearl. Welcome home, sweetheart. Right, I'll do the dishes. Oh, did you hear that kitchen slave? She's going to be doing you out of a job. Mind by me. <laughs> Coffee? Oh, please. I don't know. Where did I go wrong? How do you mean? Well, here I am, busting a gut to try and pack some toffees, and you two are just standing around drinking coffee. I thought you got to see Aaron. Yeah, I've still got to be at the factory for nine. So what's the problem? I think she's talking about the joys of self-employment. Yeah, too right I am. Yeah, but you know you'll still be packing toffees at nine o'clock tomorrow morning. I could be sat twiddling my thumbs, waiting for the phone to ring. Yeah, and once our business is up and running, I could be working all night. Oh, my heart bleeds for you. See ya. Yeah. Make us a cheese sandwich, could you? I haven't had a minute. Cup of tea to wash it down. Oh, now you're talking. She's checking up on you. No, I'm not. Take no notice of him. He wants to be a comedian when he grows up. <laughs> I'll bring it through. Thank you. Hiya. Thought I'd find you here. Do you want anything? Uh, no, you're all right. We're nearly done, thanks. All oh, right, well, you don't mind waiting, do you? Want to slurp down a cappuccino? And before you open your big gob, yes, I do know how to make them. Chocolate sprinkles and everything. Hey. But you got right, shocked, didn't you, when you got back, and no working here. They were ready, she told me on the phone. Oh, right, well, um, I decided not to call Aaron, you know, give him a bit of space. I didn't ring him, he rang me. Cup of tea, please, Hazel, and something gooey to go with it. I need reviving. Oh, treacle tart? Perfect. I was going to get something in town, but the bus didn't turn up. You should have stuck your thumb out. You can't be serious. I think she is. My car's still for sale, you know. Solve all your problems. Still haven't found anyone daft enough to buy it. Look, there's nothing wrong with it, I'm telling you. Take it out for a test drive if you don't believe me. Oh, love, I don't want to get your hopes so. up. Right, I tell you what. I'll take you into town while you do your shopping, then when you're done, I'll take you for a drink. No strings. Oh. Well, go on, then. <sighs> your mum's had enough, hasn't she? Change the locks and everything. Can't blame her, I suppose. Yeah, but it's a bit weird chucking your own sister out, isn't it? What are you having? Oh, um, dry white wine, please. Uh, I won't be doing any more driving, will I? Not tonight, you want a pint for me, please, Bob. Right, you are. So you've got to admit she's a little beauty, isn't she? Well, I was pleasantly surprised. It's very clean. Very economical. Won't cost you much to run, and I'll do you a nice price. But if you want to buy a car, you want to go to a bona fide dealer. Excuse me, I am a bona fide dealer. Look, well, you don't need to oh. buy the first car that you see. We have a little bit of a shop around. <laughs> thought of that. Well, maybe you should. And in the meantime, a little present from our holidays. Oh. Fridge magnet. You can't have too many fridge magnets, can you? <laughs> no. Oh, thank you. It, it's lovely. Wait, what are you doing? I'm giving Pearl a present. Yeah, well, I'm trying to sell her a car. Well, what, that heap of junk? Yeah, I'm getting grief off Kane. That's no excuse. Leave her alone. <laughs> 